You're watching NASA Direct. Now on the NASA Space Shuttle Status Report, passing the test. Space Shuttle Discovery gets an excellent grade on its tanking test in preparation for launch. Then closing up, Raffaello's hatch closes ready for its trip to the ISS. And work progresses on Orbiter Atlantis. NASA Space Shuttle Status Report starts right now. Jessica Rye at NASA's Kennedy Space Center, and this is the NASA Space Shuttle Status Report. We're just four weeks away from the opening of the launch window for STS-114, NASA's return to flight mission to the International Space Station. Now at the launch pad, final checkout on Space Shuttle Discovery is picking up. On Thursday, April 14, 2005, a successful tanking test was performed under simulated launch conditions on Discovery's external tank. The rotating service structure rolled back prior to the tanking test, and at 8.14 a.m., the fueling began with the flowing of liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen into the tank. Later, the ice debris team carefully inspected the tank for frost and ice buildup. Some ice is expected when propellants are loaded into the tank. The team reported both the tank and the vehicle were in excellent condition. The tank was emptied and the test was complete at 4 p.m. when the team reached the T-minus 31 second mark in the simulated countdown. Meanwhile, Discovery's cargo container closed its hatch. Inside the container, named Raffaello, are racks that will carry supplies to and from the International Space Station. This pressurized cargo container is scheduled to be installed inside Discovery's payload bay at the end of the month. Orbiter Atlantis continues making progress in Orbiter Processing Facility Bay 1. New this week, installation of heat shields on each of Atlantis' main engines. The heat shields are two semicircled shaped sections of thermal protection system tile that fit around the engine interfaces. And with boom installation complete, Atlantis is now undergoing radio frequency closed loop functional testing and systems testing for flight. Space Shuttle Atlantis has a launch window that begins July 12th and ends July 31st. That's all the time we have for this week's Space Shuttle Status Report. Be sure to mark your calendars for May 15th to June 3rd, 2005. NASA's official window for Space Shuttle Discovery's return to flight mission, designated STS-114 to the International Space Station. Until next time, log on to nasa.gov for the latest in return to flight and NASA mission news. I'm Jessica Rye for the NASA Space Shuttle Status Report. <laughs>